Tanwa and welcome to my channel firstly let us thank God for bringing us through another week um so I've decided guys that since it's December and we are all going home and all of that so I'm just going to be doing a cleaning vlog before I go home and just show you guys the hacks that I use um when cleaning and other stuff so as you can see here i'm going to be soaking my um dishcloths and yeah i hope you guys are going to enjoy this video please do not forget to subscribe enjoy sunlight has blended in with um, this sunlight as you guys have can see this spot right there yeah so you do not throw away your old um, sunlight Um, guys, as you can see, the, this part made its own pokoko. I had my um, African salad. <laughs> I had own pokoko in this, and it burnt a little. So, what I did, I put in a carbonate of soda. Um, I also put it in in hand Andy and. Um, what you call this and bleach so you never put in e e e bicarbonate of soda together with e vinegar i saw somewhere that the chemical reactions or whatever they cancel each other out so for this one um it's i don't i no longer um put in e vinegar so i just want to show you guys how Easy. It then comes off. Yeah, so I always want you guys to take out something from these vlogs, you know. Um, because sometimes that's what I also want when I watch somebody's vlog. I want to learn something or a tip or maybe like a cleaning hack or whatever. So yeah so that that's just one of another plan of how to remove your um bands ever um off your 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 parts okay and there it is guys after all of um that burnt surface kind of thing that we had there um so it has a little bit, little bit, little bit, but and remember you always wash your parts your AMC parts with a sponge. So yeah guys, let's let's plug each other. I know other people will have other um, ways of um removing 
the burns on their um, parts so you can just comment down below I'm always willing to learn as well so yeah guys hi guys so this is um below the sink uh this is what i'm gonna be cleaning and i'm also going to just pull my um my what's this washing machine and then that's where i put my gas stove and i've taken everything basically this is like yeah, guys i've never showed you my kitchen so basically oops simple um basically this is my kitchen um so i'm cleaning up as i've already told you because getting what is amber um i've just finished cutting the pumpkin then um so i'm gonna clean that thing i want to put cupboards um up below the sink but i'll probably do it next year because now i want to do this piece there um extend a why is it not focusing okay so um i want to extend the piece you know um so yeah then after that i will then um do uh, my cupboards so yeah guys let's continue go with cleaning This right here, oh, I forgot to disconnect the pen. This right here I, is an extension of the, um, the water because my um, pipe was short. Then it goes right underneath there. So you can get this at what's this builder's warehouse. <music> basically what i'm gonna do guys i'm gonna pack all my things that i bought because i still don't have um what do you call this um a cupboard or a storage thing in my bathroom then i like putting them in a plastic because it where it gets easier to clean like if there's dust and like i have to clean each and every one of these vessels if i'm just um put them in a plastic and lock and almost like like um lock it like this then i know what when i do clean i'll just clean the outside of you know this the outside of the plastic Bathroom. Um, 
I'm just going to put on my gloves now because I want to clean the mold um, up here in the ceiling. So what I'm going to be using is um, Lando's Mold Buster, right? Um, to remove the mold. But when I know, in fact, but my mold is not very tough or hard. Yeah, well, because even if I wipe it with my um with this scrub lab with a cloth, right? Um it's 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 it gets off. Like, um this is what we're gonna be using né, to remove um the mold. So because I wanna I want to get on top there and I'm a bit short, so I'm taking a crate lamp. And I'm put it. I'm gonna put it just um in the in the lendosa in the. Um, let me show you. I'm gonna put it inside there, and then I'm going to be cleaning okay, the lendosa, the, um, the 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 ceiling. So let's do that, guys. So I'm just gonna spray this and let it sit. Um. I'm not sure for how long. Uh, it says here, allow time for the product to work approximately 30 minutes. And then only scrub the areas of severe growth. Repeat if necessary. Um, the mold should change color from black to brown and eventually disappear. So let's just try this. Okay, no, I don't want. Okay, I've locked it. Because it runs all the way. I'm just worried that um what do you call this? That this thing might not fall on me. I don't know what it or it has here. Oh yeah, okay. I'm gonna let this thing sit and then I'm gonna come wipe it off. So what I'm gonna do guys, I'm gonna tie this thing and then I'm, I'm gonna use this plastic to, I don't have that thing to clean with. I'm gonna tie this and then I'm gonna put my cloth over this. And then I'm going to put my cloth over this and I'm going to hold it with um, some, 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 some rubber bands. So it's basically like this, guys. Right? So that's what I've done. I'm going to put my eyes on the plan. Right? <laughs> so I'm going to wipe with this and then, yeah, and then um, rinse it off. So this I am done. Um, 
removing or cleaning the mold that was here. I'm not sure of this um, patches that are here, but I think it's because of the weight and surface. Um, and then this side, I think I was quick to clean it up. So I'm just gonna have to redo this side. But as you guys can see, it's much cleaner than it was when we, we started. So yeah, quick and easy. I think I would recommend that um, you wait 30 minutes. Um, I was kind of in a rush and um, I didn't um, wait the 30 minutes, but um, because when I purchased this um, mold pasta, they said um, 10 minutes or so, but as I'm reading it, it had said um, 30 minutes. So I recommend that you wait 30 minutes. I think it's gonna be much easier and um, quicker to remove it. Sure, guys, and then I had rats eating the sponge of my car. So I went to Midas to get a red repellent that did not help at all because after two days they were back. So I bought in pepper, peppermint oil, which I put about 50 drops in um, a cup of water and I sprayed it over my. Um, the areas that the 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 what you call this the reds were eating since then since then i have not seen any reds anymore so the peppermint oil does really keep the the reds away so that is where we're gonna leave it for today guys i hope you learned a thing or two about my hacks and uh, my cleaning hacks the one thing i don't want is coming back in january to a dirty house or home or whatever so it's always nice to clean and do everything so that when you come back you don't have to work hard before you start work and please guys if you are traveling please be safe on the roads be vigilant and just watch out for scammers and robbers and all of that and i hope you arrive at your destinations safely and please do not forget to follow me on instagram and on tiktok babes ngalwa because that's where i mostly share my cooking on those socials and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to the channel share with your friends family colleagues and partners colleagues family friends and partners thank you so much for watching guys up until next time god bless